send a message. Senator Rand Paul has a lot of questions for former National Security Advisor Susan Rice regarding her secretive requests to unmask the names of Trump transition officials collected during routine intelligence gathering operations. And the Kentucky senator wants answers which is why he wants Rice, who's often been referred to as Obama's sister, to testify before Congress. Paul argued the situation should not be downplayed, saying reforms need to be made to prevent individuals from being blackmailed on personal aspects of their lives through unmasking. He noted there was nothing stopping the former administration from looking through Trump officials and national security advisors' conversations during the transition window. If it is allowed, we shouldn't be allowing it, but I don't think, should just discount how big a deal it is that Susan Rice was looking at these, he told reporters Monday. And she needs to be asked, backquote did President Obama ask her to do this? Was this a directive from President Obama? I think she should testify under oath on this. Paul said he has long thought there are too many people with the ability to unmask individuals. The law says you can't reverse target people, but how would you know that once you get inside the brain in the people that are unmasking people, Paul continued. So, what if I decided to unmask, and I'm there, and I only unmask the conversations of my Democrat opponents shouldn't there be more restrictions for unmasking people in the political process? He said he believes there should be two individuals at the top of the agency to allow for identities to be unmasked. Paul noted the process is indiscriminate, noting the United States previously captured every phone call in Italy for a month. Basically there's no fourth amendment, when you use these kinds of things, you go with a lower standard, because we've got to protect the country and we don't care about spying on foreigners, he said, adding there are said to be millions of Americans caught up in the country's foreign targeting. Paul said the president did not bring up the matter on their golf trip Sunday, but he voiced his opinion on the matter. Hey, thank you so much guys. Susan Rice is extraordinary. <laughs> Couldn't be prouder of the job that she's done at USUF.